Hello, this is Mrs. Davis wanting to read Little Penguin Gets the Hiccups by Tyg Bentley. Mr. Bentley gave me personal permission to be able to read this book to you. He is the author and the illustrator of this book. Oh, hello. It's so nice to meet you. Franklin said you would be here soon. I wonder if you might be able to help. You may have noticed that I have, I've got a tr terrible case of the <laughs> hiccups. It's driving me cuckoo. It all started last week on <laughs> chilly night. <laughs> I'm not sure how many penguins you know, but let me give you some <laughs> advice. Never give chili to a penguin. It gives us hiccups. I can't get rid of them. Frederick uh, told me to stand on my head. Chester told, told me to uh, drink backward from a cup. Albert told me to stand on my uh, head while drinking backward from a cup. Nothing works. But Franklin uh, has given me a new idea and I need your help. Apparently, uh, giving someone a good scare is the surest, uh, bestest way to cure hiccups. So I need you to scare me. But I really, I don't really like being <laughs> scared, so be nice. You're going to have to say boo on three. Ready? One, two, three. Boo! <laughs> Is that it? Let's try again. Louder this... <laughs> time. One, two, three, boo! Pretty scary. Maybe that cured my... <gasps> oh no. Ah! Will I <gasps> have the hiccups forever? One more time. Shout! Go crazy! Ready? One, two, three, roar! Franklin, what on earth are you doing? You told me to stand here and wait for a good scare, and then you go and jump out on me. So now my feathers are all wet, and my mom will go bonkers because she just washed them the other day. Now I'll have to wait until I'm ready to be scared again. Wait. Hold on a second. My hiccups! They're gone! Oh, thank you ever so much. Let's celebrate with a nice, spicy taco. <laughs> Just remember, be careful when you feed penguins.